more and more information is coming out about TJ Holmes. Now, we know that he is in some deep water. He and the lady that he's with now, Amy Robach, that he was co-hosting with, they're off air. Don't know when they're going to be put back on, if they're going to be put back on. But now we're finding out that he was up to no good even before he was with Amy Robach. He's been accused of being pretty much assaulting other women on, on set, that he was very sexist. He was just very overly masculine and he would pick on people. And the staff did not like him. One staff member said that he would yell at people constantly, berate them. Another person said that he had even cussed at management. Nobody liked him. On top of the fact that he was messing with other females before Amy, that tells you something. The, the Amityville Horror House, now it's up for sale. It's not the actual house. It's the house that was used in the movie Amityville Horror, up for sale. $1.5 million. Someone just bought it. It's a four bedroom, five bathroom house built in 1920, selling for one and a half million dollars. That's some huge equity you got in that house. Easy money. Pamela Anderson. She was married to this guy, John Peters, for 12 days. I mean, and this was a hot minute ago. All this time later, he still loves her and he actually has her in his will and leaving her $10 million. 12 days of marriage, $10 million. That's some easy money right there. Britney Spears, I feel so bad for her. Now we're finding out why she deleted her Instagram. She's already super upset that her fans sent the police to her house to do a wellness check. But she posted, of course, another unusual video yesterday, dancing around saying, it's me at the gym, I'm still alive. And then she kind of gave us some insight as to why she deleted her Instagram account. It was hurting her feelings. She got tired of seeing fans comment and even people that she had no, no, like reason for commenting because I'm sure they couldn't dance even if they tried commenting on how stupid she looked and she felt stupid because she was constantly compared and said that too so she was like you know what I'm just going to delete it and then the cops were sent to her house I feel really bad for her we sometimes forget with people that are super famous they are human their feelings get hurt 